This conference will now be recorded. I is equal to DBS. Today I'm talking on transactional replication and its benefit. Do you know team, uh, in replication, people call it as publisher and subscriber. Okay, why they don't call it as a primary and secondary team? Why they call it as publisher and subscriber? Do you know team? So team, the reason is team. See, primary and secondary means, okay. So secondary, the meaning of secondary is either secondary is readable or non-readable. Okay, the data always uh, uh, coming from the primary to secondary. Okay, this is always readable or non-readable team. This is how the data can be pushed. But in transaction replication team or replication, okay. So the data, uh, in replication, the data you can push from publisher to subscriber, subscriber to publisher also you can push both ways. Okay, and same time team, this subscriber, this subscriber is not, uh, I mean, not only readable team, this is always read and write. Okay, because subscriber is always read and write, we call it as a, with, we call it as, with a different name. We don't call it as a secondary team. That's why Microsoft gave the different names. Okay, publisher and a subscriber. Okay, this is the reason. Do you know team, why transactional replication uh, still, like rep replication is evergreen till now team. Okay, so in on-premise, we have log shipping, we have mirroring, we have always on, okay, clustering, I mean, uh, before always on, we have a clustering. Now people are using always on team. Okay. So more than lock shipping, mirroring, clustering, always on. So few people, few companies still preferring the transactional replication for copying the data. Do you know why team? Transactional replication, not only for, you know, a few tables or objects you can, not only you can copy. That's the only, that's not the only one advantage team. The, the other advantage is the other advantage is team in subscriber database in subscriber database you can add any number of indexes that means you can add additional indexes additional indexes you can add team so do you know the benefit of adding additional indexes on the subscriber side huh? let me talk about that so team in publisher side see publisher mostly it's a OLTP database right OLTP database and normalized database. Huh? So, okay, mostly the queries which are running on this publisher, on this database is write, writable queries. You know, I mean, writable means uh, uh, insert, update, delete. So, this is a normalized uh, database and uh, people can run uh, insert, update, delete. So, team, if you add more indexes on the tables or table in a table if you add more indexes team that insert update delete slower okay so that's why team like suppose uh, let me tell you one uh, one thing so suppose a table team uh, employee table if you are inserting a data suppose it is taking 10 seconds okay if you add an index on employee table if you insert it team it may take up to 20 seconds team see 10 times it may take more time because team, whenever you insert update delete, index also need to be updated. Okay, so indexes are good team. Okay, but up to like, so I'm not saying don't create any indexes on this database. Okay, you can create, but up to five or six indexes you can create, not more than that. Okay, if you create more team, like you are giving importance to the more select queries. More select queries won't run here, team. Mostly, if you have such kind of select queries also, please route to secondary database or subscriber database. Secondary database means in always on, you know, in log shipping. Log shipping also secondary DB you can keep, you know, readable, right? Somehow, yeah. So, uh, you can route to secondary DB or subscriber database, team. See, reports, if you want to make it faster, faster reports, if you add the more indexes, like see report is meaning what normalized data you need to make it to again uh, denormalize it that means we have to join more tables 
So if you are joining more tables means their indexes uh, required, more indexes required to improve the performance of the report. I mean, execution of the query become faster if you had the indexes on join class columns, where class columns, if you had, you know, order by columns, if you have indexes on those, it will improve. So team, uh, only in transaction, sorry, only in replication, you can add more indexes team. Even in always on team, if you create, uh, uh, so primary or secondary, if you create in always on. Always on secondary side also, you cannot create more indexes, not possible, because that's a read only, okay? If you want to add, primary side you need to add but if you add primary side these queries will slow down that's why it one and only uh, very good high availability feature is till now evergreen uh, high availability feature is transactional replication team so here you can add more indexes you can improve the performance of the reports team okay so if you want to uh, more about uh, it team go to go through this uh, microsoft documentation yeah so if you like this video team subscribe my youtube channel uh, next generation sql dba thank you team have a nice day